This is a three and a half inch floppy drive that was taken out of a mini lab that was used to develop photographs. Got a lot of cool stuff out of that piece of equipment which will be in several later videos as it's taken me a month to take everything apart but figured I'd do a quick video on floppy drives this is just plain normal computer steel now when the drives in you watch my now if you watch my teardown of a 1987 hard drive these heads are actually identical to the ones that read the actual hard drive platters in that hard drive so the body here is aluminum Pretty straightforward as far as board goes. It's not going to be a very high quality board. So, just some ribbon cable that lead up to this that's going to be just press fit nothing spectacular there just some looks like silver leads in there but guessing that there probably isn't even silver in there, it's probably just tin leads. Just more ribbon, see? Just the ribbon piece that went up to the reader. Now, even that, I figured we'd see some gold tips on those ribbons. No. I am guessing, though, that there would be silver on there, but... There's where the other ribbon attaches. see is just barely on the tips there is very little gold Here's your processor unit no it just bare on the back of this board just a whack of resistors right here like no monolithic ceramic capacitors and strips of lead, a couple switches but so small it wouldn't even make a difference I doubt there's even silver in them well this time here's the other reader head more ribbon motorize this unit back and forth to read the disc that's what I was trying to show you there's a little steel rod right there more steel you can see from these 
from the other ribbon leads here. All silver. Or possible silver leads. I don't have any solution here to test right now, so. Got to make some more. Can't remember. Actually, I'll just force it. Ah, there we go. Just another piece of computer steel. Like, really, just crap. Now, looking at here, you're going to have a motor here on this steel versus actually worrying about. this there I just cut the glove open but more computer steel here's There we go. So, there's the magnet goes all around here. More computer steel, worthless. Okay, so this is aluminum mixed with a tiny little bit of brass, very little. Like there is no weight there whatsoever. There's a couple ounces of aluminum, and here is the coils. Like, look at this board. It's just crap. It's just low grade. There is no precious metal in there. There's no monolithic ceramic capacitors. There's some resistors. This has some weight to it, but the only reason it does, it has nothing to do with the copper. It has to do with the steel that the copper is wrapped on. So anyways, there's a teardown of a floppy drive for no precious metals. 